Kent. And I'm Tim Long, an honour to be with you for this one at the 2023 Adidas Next Generation Tournament Finals. Barcelona, the first possession. Yaku Chonis, the Lithuanian, back in his home country. Has his pocket picked straight away and Gonzalez fouled. Yaku Chonis, nice hesitation dribble, got some space and got the basket. And there's a whistle. In the first two minutes littered with turnovers. Traore. Turns to face Diane, not backing down from that battle of the bigs. And this time he wins one. Working with Traore, who runs interference, switch on to Diab. Veronin can't hit the fadeaway. He's been so accurate shooting as well. Eight of 12 from two over the first two games. And Gonzalez is not hanging around. Instead, he's getting some hang time. What a way to get his first field goal. And Diab the stretch and the score. And Real Madrid back ahead. Vida, shot clock to five. Vida has Traore backed off. He paid the price. Vida getting. Yaku Chonis on the handoff with Diane out of the paint momentarily. Can't get the basket that time, but backing him up on the boards, Traore. He has struggled to shoot the ball. Traore. Up against Bozniakovic. Has the size advantage and he makes it count on the swivel of the score. Leading by one, Veronin. Real three-point threat, he gets onto the interior and he scores over the top of Traore. Oh, quick swivel. And nice footwork and an even better finish. Brilliant from Bozniakovic. Another Russian, he'll know Veronin well. Three-point shot, short. Bumping bodies underneath, and Bozniakovic picking up the pieces. Yaku Chonis, solo. Looking to run interference, switch onto the centre. Yaku Chonis, so mobile. What a pass, though, to Salo, who dunks it after Yaku Chonis took Traore away from the basket. Final minute of the first, one point margin. Demin, open three-point shot, too long, recovered, far side, flipped up and in. It's an open three. Traore, the big tip. And the free player inside will throw it down. Hugo Gonzalez looking to put Paul Sello on a poster. Nicole Demin. Gonzalez gets mid-range, little bounce pass, composure in the paint and the points for Amadou Traore. And the Traore back on two fouls, handing off to Saar. Here's that movement again on the offensive end. Can they create an open luck? They can. Three-point shot. Finally, Ella. Key matchup in the opening minutes before they both had foul trouble. Around the perimeter, Saar fakes it to the corner, looks to put it on the floor. An attack, good defence without the foul, but even better offence from Dame Saar to finally score. Gonzalez, Vida. Two main scorers for Real Madrid, both averaging 19.5 points a game. Inside to Diane, the third option, and he gets the roll around and the drop. Averaged 14 points the first two games. Gonzalez. Looking to dance, then just looking to find a teammate. Davitsky, high arc over the shot blocker. They'll battle on the boards. That situation at both ends of the floor. Dian, he's going to take it at Traore again. Not this time. Davitsky, the rebound. Now 0 of 4 from the floor. Yaku Chonis to stop the rocks. But this is the final encounter in Group A. A straight shootout for a place in tomorrow's championship game to finish as the group winners. Barca with the first shot of the second half and only the third three of the game. Demin, lovely point guard play. And then drifting and eventually dropping from mid-range, Jan Vida.
Passer on defending the perimeter well. And finally, Jan Vida. Vida. Shakes off VR and knocks it down and one. Demin wants it near side, instead it's a post up, back out from Bosniakovic. Vida, he's starting to heat up, burst to the basket, flip up and score for Jan Vida going through the gears. Shot clock down to the final five, no room to take the shot. Vida in transition, backed up on the boards, but two Real Madrid players crushing the boards, getting each other's way. Dian to the far side, shifted on, baseline opens up for Demin, they're dizzying the defence. And Almost dizzy in themselves to the point they have to slow down. Final few ticks. Demin from the corner over the top of the centre Traore. Three more turnovers in the game for Barcelona as well as that offensive rebounding advantage of a plus nine for Real Madrid. So many extra possessions. Now they're looking for the first double-digit lead. Darting through a gap, running into a Barca mid-air wall. But still scoring, it's that man again, Jan Vida. Set of circumstances. Real Madrid looking to pull away. Jakub Schonis. 15 points, a game high for him. And the three, the dagger from Demin. Has shown up here in the second half of El Clasico. Demin to Diane. And he gets the underarm. Left hand scoop and score. He's matched his game one performance. 0 of 7 on the outside. Vida! The dazzling full pace dribble from Jan Vida, who has taken over the third quarter. And Real Madrid have taken over this game. Demin showing for the ball. Plenty of movement in the Real Madrid offense. Three, three for Jan Vida, who has stolen the spotlight. Thierry now club. Invaincu donc en trois rencontres, le Real qui disputera la finale du tournoi de la NGT. La poignée de main entre Jorge Grimao et Javier Juarez. La joie sur le visage de l'entraîneur espagnol. Les Madrilènes qui disputeront donc le. Mais la finale de ce, ce tournoi Next Generation. <rire> quel match, quel match on aura vécu un classico. Donc deux victoires du Real Madrid en deux jours en l'espace de moins de 24 heures. 27 points. 27 points pour Yann Vidé, le Slovène. 6 rebonds, 4 passes, une interception. Il a été énorme, 26 d'évaluation en face. Enfin, à côté, on a donc les 11 points de 11, points, 11 rebonds quand même de Mitar Bosniakovic, les 10 points de Hugo Gonzalez, les 6 points, 8 rebonds, 4 passes, 2 interceptions des Gordemines, 10 points pour Ismail Adian et 11 rebonds, 2 joueurs du Real donc en, en double-double. Bataille au rebond remporté 50 à 29, s'il vous plaît. Et tout ça malgré un 4 sur 23 à 3 points. Et elles sont belles ces images. Elles sont belles. Le petit huddle là, au milieu du terrain pour célébrer le Real donc étant en finale de la NGT.